very quickly, uh, would be you managed to defeat uh, Truth as he was revived. Defeat in quotations. He yeah. never actually left. You are still all imprisoned. Um, and you've made him mad. <laughs> now there is a, a giant horny. voice. <laughs> I suggest you've made him charmed. I won't say he's necessarily horny. <laughs> he's targeting you for sure. <laughs> um, he's not horny? No. He's kind of a genderless being. That doesn't mean so he he's can't non-binary. Be horny. That doesn't mean that he can't be horny. He can definitely yeah. be horny. Nobody's outside of it. Nobody's outside of this big bowl. His version of horny is him being sadistic. I mean... Okay, and... tie me up and bit me. It's like, whatever. <laughs> You're getting some tentacles to the asshole. Uh, oh, so that's who this guy's targeting. Okay, cool. Well, in the meantime... Um, so are we rolling initiative? Not quite yet. Um... He hasn't been fully engaged in battle yet. He's still kind of taunting you. But as the large toothy smile grimaces across the sky, as far as your eyes can see, you do notice that the mouth itself begins to open. And black, opaque drool <laughs> just streams down from where the chin should be and starts to creep across the ground towards the party. Any thoughts on what you want to do? Or um, you just... The fuck is that? Uh, I just like hold. I just like make sure my spirit guardians are still there, and just like hold it out, like I'm trying to push the boundaries of it. Like keep that stuff away from me. The ooze itself creeps across the trees and the landscape, covering their leaves, completely making them vanish from vision. As if they're not reflecting any light. Everything it touches just disappears. It creeps across the landscape towards the temple. And over the bodies of Bastion and uh, Marnie, enveloping them as they disappear as well. It creeps closer towards everyone's feet. Not more than a few centimeters, but held off just barely at bay by spirit guardians. Yay. Um, Bone, Kip, and Vivian are with me in that spirit guardian range, and I'm pretty sure Sapphire is too. Ludwig, Deimos, you got a problem. Uh, both of you, I would like to make a constitution check. Are you referring to me and Ishmael? Deimos. Oh. Wait, me and Deimos? Yes, because you are not inside the spirit guardians at the moment. Oh. Constitution saber check. Fear, like, right towards the, uh, the dude in the black hole. Because you were you slapped his ass. You did slap his ass. Seventeen. Okay. Hold up. Let me just get in here to Constitution check, not save, just to confirm. Just to check. Yes. Thirteen. The. Oh. But, uh, the main body of truth that's standing in front of you has his arms outstretched, very maniacal, laughing eccentrically to himself as the shadows manage to bypass Ludwig. They were trying to crawl up him, but he manages to shake them off. Deimos, on the other hand, does manage to get crippled for the moment. Okay, wait, wait, wait. That should have been a save then. Mm, would it be a save? I guess it would be a save. Roll yeah. Me a save. Roll me a save. It's potentially life-threatening. Yeah, if it, if it's actually something that could be a damaging thing, that should be a stain. It's not really a, a damaging thing. He's just trying to hold you. Okay, but I, I have a, I have a plus six in my con save. That would have been a six. Okay, then roll me a con save. Uh, we'll just roll me a con save. I already rolled you a con save. Oh, okay, that's oh, a okay. seven to ten. Perfect. Um, you're good then. Yeah. Demos. Yeah, I got a 17 with a con okay. Much better. So, yes. our Minotaur friend is perfectly fine. Um, That's potential for death. The shadowy tide starts to recede back towards the mouth. The landscape rips completely to shreds. The 
trees have been all but like broken, tattered, swallowed. And as it recedes to the mouth entirely, um, make a perception. Check or save? This one would be perception save. save. I'm sorry. There's no, there's no perception save. I don't know. I've seen so. GMs do weird shit sometimes. Um, I got a 24, 18 plus uh, six. If you need a picture, I, I can take it. I got a 23. Mm -hmm. You can see it in the mo the little log. It's a nat 20 plus three. I oh, got yes, you can see mine 16, too. Because I have no bonus to perception. One plus three to make four. Hey. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um... It's all black. Yeah, you're probably too busy looking at all my spirit guardians splitting around you. You are, you, like, are standing, uh... you are standing directly behind Ishmael and sees the back of his head. So, wow, uh, what a nice head you got. A, uh, natural 20. I swore Ishmael was shorter. <laughs> what the, the rest of you um, have noticed that the bodies of Bastion and Marnie have been completely swallowed as well. Ooh. Kinky. That's um, not good. They have been taken away to the mouth. Anything oh. and everything that was alive has been completely and utterly destroyed, though. So, yeah, don't let that touch you. Nice. Okay, no touchy by the mouth. Get away. <laughs> Be gone. <laughs> Spirit Guardians. <laughs> Children who have been forsaken by life. Embrace the maws of death. What? The... Um, I'm sorry, did he just say that? Yes. <laughs> uh, no? Um... Good comeback. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I'm not very smart or charismatic. This is what I, you expect from my boy. Can I use cutting words That's on fair. him when he says that? You say what? Can I use cutting words on him when he says that? I mean, you can. His reaction. Mm, go ahead. So, um, Ludwig would probably say to him, Ha! For you think that you shan't be swallowed up by your own maul? I'll make sure that you are gobbled up and sent to hell. Uh, as a rebuttal, the mouth gives a nice little slurp. Ew. That's a rebuttal. And here's the true rebuttal. It opens its <clears> mouth <throat> wide, and an ear-piercing shriek echoes throughout the entire chamber. Ew. So, in, in response, I'd just be like, Oh, you made the thing mad now, Ludwig. I'll say, holding my, um, like, tensing my hands in midair as if trying to strengthen the spirit guardians, knowing that they're still there, just like, I, I basically think I'm summoning Violet's force field. You know what I mean? <laughs> if that this makes any time, sense. For the Shriek, I want all of you to make a con save. Mm. Of course. That's my con. Oh god. Oh, ew. Roll me a decent roll. That's a 10, baby! Here's my cutting word. I got a 10, yay! Oh, that's not oh. bad. Um, that's a 4 plus 6. Fucking hell. That's a 21 for me. 19, baby. <clears throat> 10. Oh, 19 plus Anyone who rolled lower than a 16, take 2d8 worth of thunder damage, and you are knocked towards the Void Sphere slowly. Anyone who oh, rolled no. more than a 16, you said? Less than a 16. Oh, I was about to say, I'm like, damn, that's really weird concept. Okay, wait, hold up, hold up. I need to actually roll. How do I roll on this thing? Do you need to be on? 2d6 damage? Oh, oh, I see, I see. Okay, I'm rolling yeah. now. Okay. That's uh crazy. so Oh, why are you rolling custom? What? Why are you rolling custom dice? I have no more temporary and I got knocked down a little. Oh, okay. As opposed to what? Are we doing two D six? Two D eight. Uh no, he'd be rolling a two D six. Uh two D eight. Two D eight? That would be two D eight. Yeah. He rolled I rolled a two D eight. No, he, he he's the one that rolls the damage. <laughs> Ishmael. Oh, I'm, yeah, it's his damage, oh, I'm not sorry. Really that's why I was confused. Because it's Whoopsies. like, <laughs> I, like is Ishmael doing this to me? I was like, why am I running yeah. like this? Oh, oh shoot! I'm sorry. 
Okay. Um, he rolled nine damage. Um, to the rest of it. Never, you. never mind. I'm only down two health after the temporary. Okay. Okay. Um, I will position the void sphere about fifty feet behind the entire party. This will make things Wait, a little bit easier. Wasn't it also <clears throat> twenty feet in front of me though? What? The void sphere? Yeah, because I was still in its rain last session. It was twenty feet in front of me. True. Wait, okay. does this mean that now the spirit guardians are only protecting me and not all of them? Yes. Oh shoot. Because everyone's been pushed back about ten feet. And oh wait. Oh, so I got pushed me, back about ten feet. Where me and Damos were standing, it was twenty feet from us, and we were being sucked into a pole. And then you know Ishmael was behind us, and Bone was back there. And Sapphire was right up on top of the old. I don't know. She was up front somewhere. I yeah. was in the in the area of the Spirit Guardian. That's the only thing I remember. Uh huh. But what I mean is, if I get t pushed ten feet back, then that means you guys are all exposed, and yeah. All right. Do wait. Do I get pushed ten feet back, Les? Uh, yes, you do. Okay, so ten feet back. Now y'all are exposed, with the exception of Kip and Vivian, because I'm guessing they're standing behind Bone. Pretty much. Okay. I'm also pushed yeah. back, by the way. Oh, okay. So Bone is still with me, too. Just not you, Sapir. I'm sorry. I was just confused, and now it's behind us and in front of us. I think I'm the same distance from you. It's everywhere. The mouth is in... F I think the mouth is in front of you, and the orb is behind. No, like... Yes. Was... They're two different things. No, I was saying before the void sphere was in front of us. Yeah. Scrap the thing I just said about moving it behind all of you, right? It was positioned between you before, right? Yes. There we go. So, okay, so... everyone has been knocked back ten feet from their previous position. Oh, okay. So, so. Does all this make sense now? <laughs> okay. Kinda. I'm okay. still standing in the same mask. spot because I rolled a uh, twenty-one. Oh, my brain. <laughs> now you all can roll initiative. Oh, okay, man. I'm still confused as to where everybody is, but. Cool. We'll figure it I rolled a four initiative. I rolled an eighteen. That's actually pretty good. I got a rock. Anyone who was previously standing in front of the void sphere is much closer. Anyone who was standing behind it is a little bit further. Yeah, we were standing a... behind it. They're gone. Oh boy. They is are. A... They were not showing up. They didn't show up for, like, a bunch of games, and I had already talked to them about it. And I had already talked to Les about it as well. Um, I got to my limit, and honestly, they were not contributing too much to the story, so it didn't make sense to keep them here. Yeah, I got that. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay. There we go. So. Ludwin. Ludwin? Ludwin. <laughs> Ludwin? You, you wrote it. There you go. It was of your doing. Ludwin. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome to Ludwin. Here. Huh. It's your move. Your move. No, um, we're not playing the Yu-Gi-Oh theme. <laughs> yeah. right. I'm, I'm happy that you recognized it instantly. Am I like I'm directly in front of the of um truth, right? Uh the main body, yes. Yes. Um Jackie's down. Charmed. So don't we wanna hmm. Did we um did oh. our spell slots reset? Yes. Wait, they did? Right. Oh, that's, that's, that's from good. Time, from when you guys leveled up. Oh. Oh, oh okay. Oh. That's a while ago. Yeah. <laughs> um, Darn it. Hmm. What do I want to... Okay. What's this guy wisdom like? 
<laughs> That's uh, a good hi. question. Hi. He's he's a god. Hi. Um, like a twenty high. Like, That's... yes. In the upper teens high. I won't say exactly. Okay. Like sort of Ishmael high. I'm just so kidding. So if he higher. had to do a save, he'd probably most likely succeed. Yes. All right. Is all of his stats like that? Mostly. There are a couple of caveats. Again, I won't say what. Dude, how, who, why the fuck are you putting level 6 characters against a god? The fuck? <laughs> it's um, okay, we can do this, right, Deimos? We've got this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, killed him. Uh-huh. The dude's literally standing right in front of us. <laughs> um, Standing right in front of you, correction. I guess. I would like to get close to him. Okay. And with all of my, um, Make you know, it. seduction <laughs> abilities that I don't have, <laughs> I want to try to get this dude laid. Because I want to distract him enough away from the party. Interesting choice for <laughs> that. Um, all right, then. Yeah. Do I have to roll anything for that? Um, persuasion? I guess, again, it depends on what you're trying to say. What are you trying to say? Um, I'm like... Uh, dude, I have no fucking clue what I'm trying to say. She's just like... She's trying to romance him. Okay. Like... Give me, give me... Roleplay for me. Give me something seductive. Oh my god, stop it! <laughs> no, um... You're the one saying you're gonna seduce him. Uh, or are you gonna go up to him and say, I wanna seduce you. Drop your cloak. No, <laughs> Excuse me, okay. drop I'm your cloak. Not gonna do that I'm not gonna do that again. Um, I have actual- I have seduction skills. My character's gay though, so like, this is really bad. I know, the god's um, non-binary. That's true. But he's in technically in the body of a man, right? No. Uh, not anymore. No, it is just a form. Yeah. Oh, it's just, just a form? form? Just a yeah. Shadow. It could be yeah, anything you want right. it to be. It can be whatever you want and whatever <laughs> right. you don't want. Depends on the mood. Oh, she's... Fafia closes her eyes and her head is going over and over again. This is a woman. This is a woman. This is a woman. <laughs> this is a woman. <laughs> um, and... He puts his hand on his uh, hip and his other hand on his shoulder. Baby, I can be whatever you want me to be. <laughs> <laughs> this, um, is, this is an interesting gonna... turn for someone who has not been seduced yet. Yeah. Um, <laughs> he's gonna kind of throw her hair over her shoulder. Hey. Um, and it, she's legit gonna start getting naked. She's not gonna say absolutely anything. She's just gonna sit, just, the, completely taking her clothes off. This to is the point the where she's completely naked. Yeah, okay, you're I, reducing I your armor class. I just want to confirm, this is the character that literally 20 minutes ago in the game was a child. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she's still wow, going man. through puberty, technically, even though she's a 22-year-old woman. I, whoa, 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 whoa. Last I heard, she was now 17. So wait, wait. Like she was on this 17. Now? She was only 17. So the character itself, her age is around 22, 23 in human age. And she can shift her fucking age as wow. however she wishes. When, um, so basically, when she stepped foot in the Feywild, she started aging again. Her body aged. That's rapid. But, but, but fast. Really but, fast. But fast. Yes. Very basically. fast. She's got cool. boobs now, basically. Oh, oh god. Okay, okay. <laughs> Teddy. All right, Shrugs and like and looks at the rest of you. Can we move on? You trying to kick my ass, or do I have to flay you and your naked body first? Hey, I'm trying to fuck you, sweetheart. When Jane Jane turns lolly, do I have to flay you and your body first? <laughs> I'm just, I, I'm just standing there like she got the blessing shield. She got the blessing shield. She got the blessing shield. Please. If I'm going to die, at least don't let me die a virgin. 
Um, you already did it with Bone. Remember, like we have not done it. Hey, we kissed. We didn't have sex. We kissed. Oh, okay. I thought you meant. Okay, never mind. No, you helped my room and kissed. We didn't have sex. You didn't have sex. No, we kissed. Okay. What is this thing called? Turn of events. It's okay. You're fine. Continue. Awkwardly. Can I try to enhance the mood by playing sexy music? Oh my lord. <laughs> um, can someone please make Groovy play? Um, no, like, I, yes. Can I? Can I like do a per? Can I do a performance to play? Oh uh, my a car god. Check? No, like legit. Can <laughs> someone make Groovy play that one? Um, what's the name of it? Carol's Fuck. Whisper. Yes, Carol's Anyways, Whisper. Can I? I got you, BB. Can I do a performance? Dear DM. As a reaction to this scenario? Yes. Yes. <laughs> And I, I will roll 30. my. I got a thirty. Oh, yeah, 30. I, I just, I just want to say, real this quick. whole time, right? This whole time, Damos is gonna be looking around awkwardly, and just put his hand over his eyes. So, Ludwig yeah. is gonna take out his accordion, and he's also gonna use his uh, like arm in the flute category, and he's gonna like try to use his other arm as a harp, and he's gonna like just kind of. Use an ensemble to play this Careless Whisper song. Can someone oh make Groovy play Careless Whisper? The song is a little too violent for the moment. I don't know how to work Groovy. The idea and was I'm the gonna... song was supposed to be violent, but you know what? Fine. I got you I'm gonna roll. Got... I'm I, gonna I roll have... my persuasion. I have you covered. Hope Give for the best. Oh, roll my persuasion and hope for the best. I swear Bro, it's just like staring from way back where she is but she's like holding out a double thumbs up and it's like you got this i should have been playing a um, a paladin of i rolled an 18 for that section thought... for persuasion <sighs> Not this you rolled an 18 okay i um, did what do you have to make as a response truth please the music roll. is so good did my uh, performance help at all yeah it was a 30 uh, performance check that he you know made what? Because you started playing music too, Sapphire gets advantage on top of that. Um, yes. Give me a second roll too. No, no it was lower. Head. It was lower. It was lower. Okay. Yeah. Um, I don't have any modifiers to add to it, so it's lower. Okay. Um, this will be against his inside. Be against his insight wisdom. Okay. I'm um, just. Let's say he critical fails. E twenty. Okay. What is the modifier for a fifteen? Someone remind I'm, me. I'm just gonna look at the like look at Bone giving the double thumbs up yeah, and just like oh boy, may the like may oh, the gods compel you. God damn it. Oh, what happened? Um what did you roll? I rolled an eighteen. You rolled an eighteen. What happened? And she has is... advantage. Yes. Give us the details. He rolled a sixteen. Um the modifier for a fifteen stats what? Someone remind me. One? Plus two. Plus two. Plus two. Yeah. So he rolled even. Fuck. <laughs> is that good or bad? Oh wait, that's bad. No, it's it's not even it's it's neither because. Okay, so did so, you guys talk? Uh, performance, Ludwig. Yeah. He, he rolled a thirty. Shit, you're right. You want me to re-roll my advantage dice? He he no. rolled a thirty. Okay, that's, that's like yeah. Yeah. did roll a thirty. He rolled a thirty with advantage. Okay, 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 okay. Wait, um, wait, what? Ludwig helped with advantage, so I'm gonna actually give it to Sapphire. Fuck. <gasps> Oh I'm my god! I'm taking the shit out of this motherfucker. This is unfortunate. Um, how are you gonna fuck them? Yeah, you're gonna take a lot of damage. I, I just have a question. Are, are you gonna fuck them? Like, are you gonna just embrace their darkness and become a the sword? Thing is, since like, like, let the, the saliva darkness... Just avoid that and you're good. Uh, this is what I will say as a response to it. Because you rolled even, even if it was with advantage, he still is going to do it the same way he would. Um, it's not necessarily. Uh, 
Um, yeah. You know how to get tentacle fucks. <laughs> the maw itself opens, and what looks like a giant tongue ends up rolling As right out of it. Less possible. Ooh. Yes. This is not what I want to hear. I'm just gonna like Thank look at the rest of them being like, I'm just gonna look at the nice black wall over there. Keep going. <laughs> Sorry, my mom was here. My mom was here I, and I wanted to pay attention. Repeat. Sorry. So what happens is the maw in the sky ends up opening wide and a large what appears to be a tongue tendril thing of pitch black rolls right out of it and towards the party. Oh um, no. Steph, Frick. no. Frick. Mm -hmm. what? Am I rolling a strength check? Yeah. Oh, God. Bones is going to yell out from the back. Show him with that tongue, dude! Natural one. Oh, <laughs> I did one. To a zero, because I have a minus one. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. So, I guess the I'm tongue... not pegging the dude. I guess he's going to be traumatized for the rest of my life. That is, if you have a life after this. Right. I don't think this is a good idea, but here we are. I'm just holding my spirit guardians around like, Safi, you could have been here. We could have been fine. Let him talk. The tongue Let him talk. Between, like, her legs and up around her entire body. Wrapping her entirely before quickly retracting and pulling her into the woods off of vision. <laughs> Into the oh, woods we did this thing. Ah, uh, wait. Oh no, what happened? I will say that Zephyr is preoccupied. <laughs> you would say. And is he, he fucking him. her or is she fucking him? Um, it sounds like she, he's fucking her. All there right. are places being. He kills my boy. <laughs> My lord. Because I need I mean, to I need to prepare a reaction for it. So I need to die. know who's, who's or what. <laughs> oh my god. There is an apple in a tree being tongued right now. I will let you know that. <laughs> Wait, what? There is definitely an asshole in a tree being tongued right now. Okay. okay. Then. Well then. So she's getting I will eaten, let so she's getting eaten out in both holes. At the moment. <laughs> Okay. I will let you all know, though, he has disadvantage for roles now because he's partially preoccupied. Oh, oh, oh we're still fighting him while he's fucking staff here? The rest of his that body is here. Attention. The rest of his body is here and the tongue is preoccupied. Do I take damage from that? Uh, no, but I will have you make a wisdom save every turn, actually. <laughs> oh, that sounds smart. Um, yeah, that was not very good. Um... A wisdom save. Yeah. Yeah. Just remember, you have bless. I think that applies to saving throws. Um. What's bless yes. again? Bless gives you a plus one d four for all saving throws. Yeah. It's specifically nice. for saving throws. So. So. You also have a shield if you're going to be attacked by that poor tongue. That doesn't make it any better. Um. That was a nine. It's not like she's dodging the tongue. No. There's just a lot of wet and lovely saliva. Love is black. That's a word I didn't expect. Um, to be I rolled a nine on the wisdom save. Oh, oh gosh! With the D four? Yes, I had. I rolled. No, a ten. I rolled an eight plus one. So, and I rolled a one on the D four. Uh, so I wasn't your... expecting to use. <laughs> what happens with your last rift? She's gonna get um... fucked up. Sounds like you're gonna get fucked. No, I'm right. talking about actually mentally fucked up. Traumatized. So, yeah. To be expected. The tongue envelops you entirely, flipping over your sensitive bits very sensually. Not his usual traumatic endorsements. And you are slowly but surely losing your mind <laughs> to truth. In pleasure or in general? In both. Oh my. All I'm right. just looking at Bone like. Very well be I am going to be very honest. I don't think she would enjoy it. No, not necessarily. But you are very well like on the borderline of being corrupted. She's like not enjoying it at all. She's doing okay. it to save the party. 
You were losing your virginity. Technically, she's still virgin. There's just a lot of tongue action going on. I'm I'm looking at Bone like you better help your lover girl over there. The moment the moment there is actual sex involved, she's gonna get like she she's actually gonna resist. For the moment, that is if you aren't corrupted by that point. Yeah, that's true. I will say the overall result of this, if you completely worst case scenario, is Come. A traumatized, but B obedient to truth. Mm. Oh boy, that's like submitting, but to that level. Am I having my Yasha moment? Yeah. Am I, am I having my brainwashed Yasha moment? I love yep. it. Do you? Um, we know, don't know because we're the rest of the party, and we're about to get killed by this thing. So y'all do your thing. I have no idea what's I'm happening. Over here getting traumatized. No, you just so... saw Saphir get carried away from the perspective of your party. In a more reasonable yeah. outlook. Out of D and D, this is basically your standard tentacle hentai. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> kind of, yeah, but so, people gotta die. But this is not where I was trying to go with this, but you know, fair enough. Wasn't okay. what I was expecting this session. I'll be honest. So, yeah, the well, the rest of us, we better ball that truth guy pretty quick before mm -hmm. she becomes a what's it called? A, a vampire spawn at this point. Are we uh, switching back to the serious music now, or are we keeping good old Fearless Whisper for the rest of this? Um, until he loses disadvantage, I'm gonna say we keep this. So You're just, still playing, dude. So I'm just playing Careless Whisper perpetually. Yeah. Um, how many times do you want me to roll that wisdom save? Um, I'll say... Every turn? Oh, shit. Because it's still initiative um... order, so... Right. Yeah, I'll say you have to roll it at least three more turns, as long as it gets to your turn. Okay. I don't even know what to do here. I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys. Yeah. I, well, actually, well, I'll leave this up to you. Right now, uh, there is a Void Sphere in very close proximity to quite a few of you, and Truth is standing in front of you, still being a little bitch. So... Wait, Damos and Ludwig, I thought, were the only ones really close to the sphere because the rest of us were behind it and we got pushed away. Yes. We failed the concept. So now they're closer to it. They are closer to it and we are farther away. Yes. Okay. You have more freedom of movement right now. Okay, Bone, Kip, <laughs> uh, Viv, we need to do this. Please. Um, so, can you tell me again what this sphere that I'm really close to is about? So the sphere is Instant a void death. sphere. Yeah, it's it'll crush you. Mm. Mm hmm. Simple as that. So we'll basically, get, the, get um, the heck out of there. Make a make an insight really quickly, if you want the real information on it. I'll make that insight. That was a seven. I'll make an okay. insight check. Okay. Good. I rolled a nineteen. I mean, Ooh. 16 plus 3, that's 19. I rolled a 23. Okay. 13. Dave understands nothing. Bone? I, I, as usual. Bone, what did you get? 13. 13? I got a okay. 23. Okay. Um, Bone understands the mechanics of how it works. Like, it will... It's a gravity sphere, basically. Um, The rest of you, that is not Deimos and Bone, understand that this is the bowels of truth. This is basically his stomach. If you go oh. in, you don't come out. Ew. I don't want to be in this guy's bowels. <laughs> so they get the heck away. <sighs> Feeding time, yes. You know what? You can stop saying bore. <laughs> A very agitated truth looks over at Ludwig. Enough of your nonsense. <laughs> Enough! I just, I just want to scream in Ludwig. Ludwig just scream out, Oh, so you're going to be cutting us into four, hey? I didn't know you were that kinky. Yeah. I have to do my food. How delectable. <laughs> well then, I guess we'll chew you through thoroughly. Whatever you are. 
You're planning to eat me instead, Ishmael? No. I, I didn't mean it like that. You are God. You have high wisdom. You know what I mean. Do I? Do you? <laughs> I, I just I just roll my eyes like, oh boy, we'll stop playing games. Just go on. Please Get stop on the playing show. games. Just kill us already. Just, kill us. <laughs> just get on with the show. I, I want to have Guys, a new please. character. I'm, I'm not getting fucked by this dude for nothing. <laughs> Believe right. me, I wanted to beat this thing. To be I fair, don't... he's not fucking you. He's playing with you. <laughs> Same Still, shit. close enough. Close enough. I don't even know what to... Okay, you know what? So, wait. If I get closer to him, I get too close to the gravity sphere and I can get sucked in? Uh, if you get close to him, you're fine. If you get close to the sphere, you're very not fine. Okay, so it's my turn. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try to, like, get closer to him, because I care not for the sphere. Um, I want you to make a strength save. Not strength save, strength check. Sorry. Okay. But it could be potentially life training. Strength save or check? Check. Can I do athletics? Does that make better sense? Yes. Thank you. I have proficiency yeah. with athletics. That's a 14. Whoever's checking... Oh. Uh, to let you know, whoever's checking against the sphere for being pulled into it, you can use either dex or strength. Okay. So acrobatics or athletic. Yeah. Both make right. sense for this. All right. So you got what? I got a 14. You healer panic have reduced movement. That's fine. I'm headed away from the sphere to the to the beast thing, the big boy, the god. He waves at you uh, playfully as you're only able to move 15 feet in his direction. He's about 45 feet away from where Deimos is standing. Great. So wait, where I'm currently standing or where I was starting? Um. Where you are starting. So Great. Not... So then I'm going to use my action to dash. Okay. And that gives me 30 more feet over there. Ooh. Okay. And so I should be able to get in front of him. And then because I dash, I should be able to use my bonus action to attack. Him. Yes. Yes, you can. Because that's... Get there, Dables. Get nice. there. Yeah. That's scoring rush. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to take a horn attack and that's a 15 to hit okay um i do believe that hits Let's okay see. great wait does bless apply to attack rolls or damage rolls i forgot i'm sorry uh, i do not remember either oh i will i will go it doesn't roll to damage rolls i think it does help for attack rolls so that would have been higher still either way that's nine um eight damage eight piercing damage okay that's fine yeah. Um, yeah, it does apply to attack rolls, Deimos. You stab right. into his arm, and he grimaces a little bit, but he brushes it off. I really hope that you understand you are charging a god. I won. I understand nothing. <laughs> Touche, Mr. Bull. Touche. I don't understand this whole thing. I don't know what we are doing. But I am here, and I will do it. You are attempting to kill me, but I don't know if this is going to go too well for you. I don't think it's healing. I think it's more trying to stop you from killing me. Hmm. Admirable. Survive if you can. Next turn. That's all I can do. Yeah. Who's up next? Gotta love it. What were you uh, saying? Truth's turn. Oh boy. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah. Um, I, for I forgot. How much armor class do you have, Deimos? I have a 15, but you gave Just... me um, Shield of Faith, right? Yeah, plus two. You have 17. <laughs> yeah. A little better. A little. A little tiny. So, what does Truth what do? Is my dear Truth want to do. Um. I will say... Oh wait, he's in my spirit guardians. He has to make another save. He does. 
So oh, make, he has make, this advantage. He makes he yeah, yeah, but it is a, it is a wisdom save. But still, he has disadvantage. He has disadvantage. Uh, let's see. What is he? Um, what you said fifteen to four. Yes. So he has a plus two with disadvantage. Um. Okay. So with disadvantage, he's managed to roll a sixteen. Oh, detestable being. Okay, let's see. I want to see if it's half damage. Hold up. Uh, half as much damage. Okay, so he takes half of... He takes 11 damage. Ooh, very nice. Very nice. It would have been 22 if it weren't for those stupid kids. I mean, the meddling dog, too. <laughs> <sighs> testable spirit guardians. <laughs> I no. love the word testable. My children would not be very happy with you. <laughs> well, my children? fellow would it be? How did you heave children? He snaps his fingers, and a very child is born. You, two shadowy figures actually appear behind who? Too young to be a mother. The fair, uh, the party. Who's the two farthest people in back? Ah, uh, well, Bone and I got pushed back, so I think it's probably going to be Bone. Um, do these things have health? Because then they'd have to make the wisdom save too. They do, but they are far in the back. So, so um, they're okay. They're about thirty feet behind Ishmael. Okay, so they're out of the spirit guardian range. But if they want to come in here, then uh, spirit guardians. You hear maniacal cackling, but it almost sounds familiar. Oh gosh. Okay. Um Okay. Um where are campaign notes? Here we go. Oh my god, it's Marnie. And Bastion. Frick, are we really gonna have to fight them? They have like two hundred something million health. Make a insight check. <sighs> This is OOC. I I know it's Marty Bash. Yeah, well, this is OOC too. I know so too. Uh, 15. It is what appears to be them. It's definitely their figures. Are we really going to have to take out 200 something's worth of health all over again? Are they still damaged from before? Nope. Fuck. So basically, they're back to full health. Okay, everybody, bum rush the truth, boy. Because they're, they're probably going to disappear if he disappears, so it'd be just less effective attacking them. Remember, we messed up the first time. They both look at you as you attempt to go ahead and try and talk about attacking truth. We've been given a second chance by the Almighty. You really oh. think we're just going to let you do that? Yes. No, we don't. But at the very same time... We want you out of here, you detestable beings. I mean, you almost, what's it called? You did this for your own selfish intentions, and then you caused this, and then we had to clean it all up. We had to clean up you, for heck's sake. So, actually, we, you up. we, had to give you we know very well that you want to stop us. But even then, this truth guy, he gotta go. Our previous selves might have done this for selfish intentions. But there is no greater gift than being able to serve truth. Ha! Huh. And so you bring able what to lie. says. Huh? Hmm. What do I want to do? So he did that as one action. He's going to move away from uh, Deimos with his remaining movement. About another 30 feet away from the Okay, park. if you're going to try to move away from me, I get an opportunity attack. You do. Yes. And that's a nat 20. Yee! Sexy. All Wait, right. hold on. And I get to re-roll those two twos. So let me roll the 2d6 again. So minus four, 
So that's going to be plus six. 23 damage. 23. Nice. Watch 23. your god freaking die. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's a very aggressive freaking Ishmael. Don't try right to get away from me. And he can't move, by the way, if I hit him. Oh, right. You got Sentinel. Nice. Yes. Um, if he tries to move, um, creatures... Uh, when a creature... When you hit a creature with an opportunity attack, the creature's turn movement becomes zero. Okay. okay, okay so we okay, can't okay. move. Okay. Um. All right, you've got him rooted. Good shit. Now on bone to tie him up. Bone. Yeah, because even if he uses the <laughs> action, his speed is now zero. So go and do something helpful, please. Ensnare uh, the poor thing. Don't try to um, get away. even work. Is it a physical enough form for me to like? I mean, I guess it would. It wouldn't matter, but this is definitely a physical form. I'll tell you that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah I'll... What I can do is, yeah, I'll I'll do in, I'll I'll cast ensnaring strike as my. Uh, um. What do you call it? I think it was my bonus action, right? Yeah. Okay, again. Yeah. Okay. So, boom, ensnaring strike, bonus action, and then I'm gonna try to give him the old shoop shoop with my bow shoop, shoop. and arrows. Shoop, shoop. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let me roll. Like your arm? Yeah. Okay. Twenty. Okay then, yay, good Not job, Bo. 20. 16 plus 4. Okay, still. Oh. Man, it's a hit. That is more than, more than solid. Hell yeah. Alright, damage is gonna be... 3. Think. Heck yeah! <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice, nice. It's okay, you're doing it, you're doing it. But, also, this you're bitch uh, is baby ensnared. It has to do a strength save. Oh, wait, does it do the first turn or the next turn? Yeah, uh, make, make a saving throw. Make a strength strength save. Ooh, okay. Get wrecked. During his turn? Uh, do it now. Do it now. Okay. Do it now. <laughs> you gotta be able to, to ensnare uh, you. 13. Give me the save straight. Give me that fucking save. 13? <laughs> You said 13? Yeah. You are safe. I, I am gotcha. unsuccessful. Woo. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, wait, but if his movement speed is reduced to zero... Okay, never mind. Yeah, he can't move. He can't move. He okay. can't move. He can still be... He still he doesn't have disadvantage for deck save. Okay. Now it's Vivian and Kip's turn. Let's hope that Vivian wait, just unleashes inner dominance. I can, I can shoot dominance. another arrow. Oh, you I can. can I forgot. <laughs> I have one more arrow. I can shoot. I can get another dink in. Oh, not twenty. Ooh, oh, shit! That's two d ten. That is one big dink. Yep. So twenty-four in total, and then damage is going to be six. Uh, six natural or six after doubling. Uh, I rolled a one and a four, and then added one, so it says crit six. Okay, okay that's then. Sad. Uh, congrats. Congrats. It's okay. You took out almost a tenth of this thing's health. Yeah. Back. Now, Kip and Viv just need to do their job. Right, Vivian? Uh, just he just works and is tempted to throw you at truth for your unnecessary optimism. Who's who? Vivian. Oh. Well, I'm still going to look at her and just be like, okay, please. I'm not your wife. You do not need to give me this unnecessary optimism. <laughs> well, everybody's got to have a little optimism. I mean, don't you guys get that fire inside of you, you know, trying to kill a god? Or an effigy of a god, whatever, still. Trying to kiss a god? Or at least <sighs> fuck a god? This is true. Um, you know what? Actually, to go along with that, that 
you have made her a little bit fired up. I want to see if she can make a acrobatics to actually get over the sphere. Let's see. Oh boy, is she literally gonna flip over the freaking spear? At She's spear? Gonna jump the spear. Wait, but but yeah she's she was closer to us within the spirit guardians we're all away from the sphere so is she trying to just run over to the sphere and jump over it yep away from truth what do you mean away from wait you truth is all right the by spheres us in front of them the spheres far far away from her no the sphere is closer to truth yeah yeah because we're that all was by right next to me and i was over there yeah. Oh, okay. And then there's the rest of us, along with Kip and Vivian, along with the rest of us. Yes. Yeah. So she's trying to get closer to Truth by actually getting around the sphere very quickly. Okay, then. Interesting choice. So, your dex is plus four. I mean, let's see. Please, please, please make, please make badass. Please be badass. Please be badass. Uh. Not badass. I don't know, actually. Wait a minute. <laughs> Gotta fuck that. No, wait, what? Uh... 12 plus 4, 16 in total. Void Sphere save is 15. Okay. She passes. Just, oh my god. Just fucking barely. <laughs> she... <laughs> Can she still look like a total badass just for passing? It clips her heels, but she does make it over. She's standing fairly close to it still. But she is able to move another 15 feet. So she's about 30 feet behind Amos. Great. Now then. Kip, are you going to do anything useful this fight? Fantastic. Mm. He's going to do the smart thing and go the long way. <laughs> okay. I thought he was going to try and confuse Marnie and Bastion by, like, getting in their head. I mean, there's no reason he squeaks at you and shrugs. There's no reason to stay directly in front of these two idiots. I mean, you've got that right, you little thing. You say, I say it, like, kind of fondly, just because, you know, cute little adorable owl. So where's, uh, where's Kip moving to? Kip is moving around the side, uh, out of the sphere's range. Can I wave to him? Um, Got it. Smart wait. Kip. Um, he's, uh, he's moving to the left and around, so he's basically going to dash all the way, like, about 60 feet. I'll say I just want he's... To wave to him. You're waving to him? Yeah, just like, hey. He, he moves to you. Okay. Oh, he's moving to me? Yes, he moves to you. Oh. Mm -hmm. Gives you head pats and then continues past you. Oh. He pats oh, the I robot. That's a good little bird right there. <laughs> it's just um, Naruto running around the spear. <laughs> he is relatively close to Deimos. A little bit out of range. Maybe about 10 feet. Um, so now we are Ishmael's turn. Okay, so I'm just going to, like, envision truth in my head and then just shove my hand forward, casting Sacred Flame. Okay. Sexy. Okay, uh, deck save from truth. Yep. He got a... What? what? He got a what? Um, adding his modifier. Hold on just a second. He got a uh, plus two. Ooh. So wait, what? He got a fourteen. My saving, my save thing is a fourteen. So it's even. Does he make it? Barely. It's even. Okay. If it's even, it, he beats it. Okay. He's fine. Because it's your okay it's your DC. So I just be like launching the sacred flame at him, and it just kind of like bursts over his head. Yeah, if you were rolling and you both made the same numbers, then it goes to the player. But if it's a DC, if you meet, you beat. Period. Okay, I get it. Yeah. 
So it just kind of explodes over his head in like almost a firework fashion. Pop. How pretty. If Was a warning that, shot. It's, it's like a firework. It's like a yeah. sacred fly firework. My god gave me the power to do fireworks. Uh huh. If you entertained me, then you've done a fairly decent job. Oh, well, I'm flattered. I always like to put on a good show, you know? I'm sure you can relate. You can put on good shows after I've eaten you. Cool. Thank you. That's just his only response. Cool. So, whose turn is it now? Yours. Okay. <clears throat> so, Ludwig is going to... I want to move... 30 feet behind me. Mm-hmm. Or I want rather I want to move like 30 feet to like the left away from the sphere. Okay. So I can still see Truth in my vision, I can still see Ishmael in my vision, but I'm not like blocked mm -hmm. anymore by it. Yeah, you're like at the edge of the temple platform right now. Yeah. Am I okay. still in its like sucking range? Um you're experiencing gravity minimally. Okay, so like I can still like, I'm not gonna be like sucked in or anything. Exactly, you don't have to make strength checks. Okay. Um, next, I want to throw a grenade into the stomach of the void, since you did say this is stomach, right? Basically. I want to yeah. throw a grenade in there and see what happens. Okay. You and fuck. I think it's gonna get utterly obliterated. That's just me though. Um. Okay. Uh, you throw it in, and you do hear a large explosion Oof. 